Hello there, this is Battle of W. Hansen again with one of my little home videos here. I'd rather than do a just a Elvis or Buddy Holly or something today. I'm gonna do a song that the lyrics originated with me, the music, I'm not sure where it came from, but a few years ago I was auditing a player here my auditing job and I'm a Christian person. I'll say right off, I believe the Bible is entirely inspired word of God in the original languages. That Jesus is is God in the flesh, was God in the flesh, Yeshua. And I won't get into all the details here, but it's a lot of great creation science stuff on the web out there. I'm a bit ashamed of that. The only problem with, the only science that disagrees with scripture is man's interpretation of science. It's just one interpretation, they'll use the same evidence. There's much evidence that there was a great flood one uh, one time not long ago. The Earth is actually quite young and dinosaurs didn't live with humans. I look at answers to Genesis or Institute of Creation Research to find these things out. But anyway, I was that being my belief, I thought this lineup one time uh, at work. I thought uh, made this up. Uh, the carpenter is coming back to fix his creation, nail iniquity. Sound out all injustice and varnish this world with truth and love. And my coworker Rosie Swanson said, "You know, I, I like that saying. So I wrote it on. I wrote it on a board and had it work for about a year. And then I got to look at that and I thought, well, that'd make a pretty good song. So and then I just like that. I'll, and I made up three verses for it pretty fast. It's not a real long song, but I call it the Carpenter. And then uh, I, I, this tune just popped in my head, and I'm not sure where I got the tune from." I, I don't really write music. I'm pretty good at taking lyrics and applying them to uh, to a sub existing melody. I'm pretty good at that, but uh, I don't really write music as such myself. But uh, that tune popped in my head, so it might be from somebody else. It's going to be positive, but the lyrics are mine originally. Anyway, the song goes like this, because I truly believe that the Lord is going to come back, just as the scripture says. His kingdom will be set up. All this suffering, all this is temporary. The original creation was not like this. It was perfect. And the world's better explained. It's just leave what scripture tells you like Ken Ham said. It's, what you see is what you get in the real world. Everything fits with what the Bible says it is. Man wasn't there. The scientists weren't there. Jesus was there. He's the creator. And he believed in all those things. Noah's flood, Adam, me being real people. So there's no reason whatsoever really outside of human beings' interpretations. Otherwise, it's real science just it totally agrees with Scripture. Anyway, the song goes like this. He came to this earth by his virgin birth. He lived the perfect life for 30 years. He worked as a carpenter with his hands. The one who made the stars labor as a man. And now the carpenter is coming back to fix his creation. Nail iniquity, send out all injustice, and varnish this world with truth and love. He started his mission as God's true lamb. He fulfilled many prophecies throughout the land. He was the suffering Messiah, Yeshua, my Lord. Now he's coming back to judge with his sword. And now the carpenter is coming back to fix his creation. Nail iniquity, send out all injustice, and varnish this world with truth and love. He died on a cruel cross, his scripture foretold. Jehovah God come in the flesh, a creator of old. But he rose from the grave after three days, giving life to believers, their souls to save. And now the carpenter is coming back to fix his creation. Nail iniquity, send out all injustice, and varnish this world with truth and love. And now the carpenter is coming back to fix his creation. Nail iniquity, send out all injustice, and varnish this world with truth and love. Well, that's what I believe. I have fun with karaoke. I sing at nursing homes. I, I entertain them for maybe an hour or so. 
And at the end, we always do gospel songs. And I love Buddy Davis from Hasn't Jazz Ministries particularly. His songs are really cool. <clears throat> I like this one, though. I'll put this in here. When you're down at your lowest, remember God's still at his best. He'll open doors that you don't know exist. Don't surrender, you're not beaten, though the world may say you're through. My God did not make you to what you lose. Where there's sadness, he get a laughter. Where there's darkness, he shines a light. If there's no hope stained on your doubt, a miracle is inside. My God, he hands out victories and he'll give them to you. My God did not make you to what you lose. If you doubt that Jesus answers prayer, he's not a hit or a miss. Get those cobwebs of doubt out of your head. The God who made the universe can make your dreams come true. My God did not make you to what you lose. Where there's sadness, he gets a laughter. Where there's darkness, he shines a light. If there's no hope stained on your doubts, a miracle is inside. My God, he hands all victories and he'll give them to you. My God did not make you to what you lose. So always keep your chin up, ask and he will do and don't give up. My God did not make, make you to what you lose. Amen. Yep, I love Buddy Davis. I'm probably his biggest fan. He's a cool guy. It took 32 years to get his dream. He ended up being a singer. Singer for God now. So it's just a great thing. All right. Hope mine comes true. I just want to be able to sing more in nursing homes. And, and uh, do a lot more than I do one a month right now. But I'd love to do that. I think it's doing what Jesus said. At least to these, do it for them. And I love my mom. At least loved her mom. And do that for people in nursing homes. That's the greatest thing you can do, I think. I really like that a lot. That and do stuff for kids. Maybe like to sing for youth groups too, that'd be fun. Karaoke is a is a great tool of use, just like anything else. It can be used for bad or good. Okay, well, God bless everybody and that's my little video. Well, how's the sun off there?